My name is Dan Doan. I'm Dave Grayken. Hey, my name is Rob Ash. The nonlinear editing world went through a major change in July of 2011. With the release of Final Cut X, things have not been improved. We decided to look around and see what the other options were. About 14 years ago, I had to use Premiere for a job. I wanted to do a dissolve between these two shots. When I went to render, Premiere said it would take 64 years. Things have certainly changed in Premiere Pro since then. Premiere is a good product that professionals ought to check out. A huge time saver for us is being able to work natively with our 3D footage. Now I can edit all my home movies in 4K. Even more groundbreaking, you can open FCP7 projects through XML directly in Premiere. No third-party app. That's sweet. Some people call it Final Cut 8. Premiere Pro takes advantage of the Mercury playback engine. Well, Rob's going to have to explain it. The big piece of tech behind it is the Freddie Mercury playback engine. What? Here's how it really works. The Mercury playback engine is a 64-bit optimized massively multi-threaded video playback and rendering engine that fully leverages all the cores. Of the Much better than the Venus playback engine. That thing was a piece of <laughs> Premiere Pro works fantastically with Adobe's other products like Photoshop, After Effects. It makes making titles very simple. You know, you can just add your word and then make it nice. You can do stuff like Whoa! Wait, that was <laughs> a little bit, a little bit too much there. Adobe gave us a sneak peek at the interface of the next version of Premiere, and I'm going to show it to you right now. So get ready. All right, ready, ready. Wait, okay, that's it. What about now? What about now? It's actually got a timeline, an audio mixer, bins, a source and record monitor, and uh, my personal favorite thumbnails that are not literally as big as a thumbnail. Premiere has great integration with Adobe Story. It makes it very easy to find very complicated dialogue. So, Rob. Hey, Rob. Hey, Dan. Hey, Dave. Hey, Dan. Hey, Dave. Cool. What's <laughs> up? So, you know. All right, thanks. Now, between Premiere, Encore, After Effects, it's really simple to make a DVD, you know, Blu-ray, whatever you need. Adobe's going to be offering Premiere in their upcoming Creative Cloud service. It's going to have all the programs that I know and love, plus every other one that I have no clue what they do. Really, what does Flash Catalyst do? No one knows. Adobe's really helping editors learn Premiere. I had a question about Premiere. I posted it on the interwebs, and you know, John Adobe himself gave me a phone call, and he was very helpful. He's better than Steve Abbott. That guy was a Hey, we want to say thanks for watching this video. We really think we found a great company in Adobe. Premiere's pretty cool. It's going to be pretty rocking. We think your kids are going to like it. Your dog's going to love it. Unless you're a whiny you should check it out. <laughs> you don't see any of my fat, you know? Yeah.